my brother, the business that you're doing, you remember you used to do a business? Huh? There was, there was a business on a drug business. Huh? There was a drug business that you used to do before. So now, because Daddy said I must declare money today, Amen. you are one of those people that I, I want God to give you money. I want God to give you money because I saw things that you're doing in the past. Amen. So now God has brought you to the light. Amen. Are you hearing me? Amen. So there's money that God will give you. There are business connections that are coming. Amen. Take it! My name is Kevin Matebula. I'm coming from Bushbuck Ridge in Pumalang. And can you tell us the prophecy you received today and also confirm it? Uh, the prophecy that I've received today, the man of God said to me that God is, bring, is bringing the financial breakthroughs in my life and delivering me from the, the businesses that I was, I was in, in darkness, the darkness business that I was involved in, in before, before I come unto light. So the business that I was involved in, which was in darkness, it, it is that I was uh, stealing, I was involved in criminal activities, so to say, stealing and selling goods unto, unto people that were dealing with. So until 2012, where I was uh, arrested after dealing in drugs, Drugs, so is when the light of God and the truth of God come, came unto my life to see that the way I'm living, being involved in all criminal activities, I'm going nowhere, is where I have fully decided to come to God and follow God through fully. fully. So I confirm the prophecy to be true that I was involved in the dark business. So, and I also received the prophecy as saying that the financial breakthroughs has come unto my life today and my family in the name of Jesus. And with this prophecy, what is it that you believe God will do for you? I believe that God will change my life forever in the name of Jesus. I have received my financial breakthrough in my career, in my business, in my family, in every area of my life in the name of Jesus. And yes, and my life will never be the same again. Amen. My brother, in your family, this one. In your family, you people, this one. In your family, you people you are caged like this. Amen. And remember that it's like God gave you people a grace. Amen. Of business also. Amen. Because of the business ideas that always comes to your mind. Amen. And remember your brother also. Yes. When I'm saying a drug business, this man was doing the same business as your brother. Amen. That one. That one. Amen. So now, I want God to change things now. Are we Amen. Amen. I want God to give you connections that when your enemies are looking at you, will be ashamed. Amen. Take it. My name is George. I'm come from Crystal Park in Benon. The prophecy and confirmation. Yeah, the prophecy was true. What the man of God has said to me was true. I registered business and it, it, uh, it has not been working for the past two years. So what he said is, is true and correct. No, I just registered a business and it was not functioning. I didn't have the energy to, 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 to submit my, my profile. And now that the man of God has spoken to you, what is it that you believe that God is going to do for you? I believe there will be change, especially in my work, in my working environment and also in my business as I'm going to start applying for, for the new, 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 new businesses. Yeah. There's money coming to you. There's money coming to you. I saw another brother here. My sister, lift her up. There's a young girl, I want also to give an example by this girl. There's a girl who's staying in, I'm seeing a place called Ivory. 
you stay in Ivory, you apply it, you want a job from outside. A small girl. Our, also, money is coming to you. It's a small girl. Small girl. Let me go there. You want money? Yes! <laughs> There's a small girl. What is she? What is this small girl? This, this one. Come here. You. Oh. Say, God, fill my account. God 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 fill my account. I want God to give you a job outside. Amen. Amen. Are you hearing me? I want God to give you a job outside. Because that's your cry. You want to you want God, you know, to help you so that you must be able to help your family. Huh? Your mom is a problem that I don't want to talk about. She cries every day. Yes. Huh? And your sister also. <laughs> huh? Now listen, let me tell you. Daddy said we must declare money. That's why I came to you there. Are you hearing me? God will honor you and your enemies will be ashamed. Come out! God fill my account. Say God fill my account. No, you're blessed. There's a business that is coming of cooking is coming. You're blessed. You want money? My name is Lerato Ramathale. I come from Beshli. Uh, today, men of God located me and told me that money is coming. And I believe that, and he told me about the business of cooking, of which I was thinking about. And I, I even told my husband to buy me equipment of catering stuff. And yes, I believe God is going to do that for me. Amen. The, Amen. There's a business. Yes, it's true. Are you hearing me? Yes. There's a business that you're doing. It's fluctuating. Yes. Huh? Yes. Going up and down. Yes, but it's you, true. Need, you also need to be careful about some people around you. Are you hearing me? Amen. Because there are people that are not living right also. Amen. Are you hearing me? Amen. These people is like sometimes they drink. It's true. Huh? It's true. Leave these people, leave these people. Money is coming. God bless okay. you. Okay. Uh, my name is Charles Mokonko. I'm coming from Ebony Park. And can you tell us the prophecy that you received today and also confirm it? Yes, the prophet, uh, the prophecy that I get it today is true because uh, I have the business, uh, I'm selling a lot of things and then uh, it's really true about that and I'm so happy about that. I confirmed it's true. And were you praying that God should locate you concerning this? Uh, I pray by all means because I know if I pray and only if I believe, everything is fine. I mean, I encourage everybody, if you come to charity, if, if you have the belief, everything is possible. And what are you believing God is going to do for you today, uh, from now on, as the man of God has located you and also prayed for you? Uh, I mean, really believe everything is going to be fine because I believe. And I see a lot of things happen if I'm still attending here in Charis. I want to pray for you. Amen. Are you hearing me? Amen. I want to pray for you because when you're growing up, it's like this thing has been happening in your family. That in the old days, you people used to have like animals. Yes. Huh? Yes, we have the li livestock. We have sheep, I'm seeing we have livestock, cattle, we have, different yes. livestock. Exactly, yes. Huh? Yes. So now let's turn this livestock into money. Amen. Are you hearing me? Amen. So you want God to do that? Yes, yes, huh? yes. Amen. So God will bless you until you don't know, you people, what you are doing with this livestock. Amen. Are you hearing me? Amen. Because sometimes it's like devil is attacking this life. They just die in a funny way. Yes. Huh? Yes. So now let me tell you, there's money also that is coming. Because I'm seeing you, you also do this, you will do this thing of selling and buying. 
Are you yes, me? Yes, yes. God will give you that grace. And I know what was happening in the family because there were a lot of divisions also. Exactly. Are you yes, me? Because yes. of this. So, yes. but God will fight for you. Let's believe God will bless you. Amen. Because that's the grace that God gave you people. Amen. Of animals, Amen. livestock. Amen. Come on. In Jesus' name, you're blessed.